the narcissist knows nothing about you. They act like they know you so well. They act like they know everything about you. As though they have all of this knowledge and information about you. And in their minds, they are absolutely certain that everything they know is correct. But this couldn't be further from the truth. The truth is, the narcissist really knows nothing about you. They never took the time to get to know you. They never paid attention to you. They never asked you for information about yourself. So how could they possibly know anything about you? Whenever you had a conversation with a narcissist and tried to give them information about you, they never listened. They just hijacked the conversation and started talking about themselves. So how could they have learned anything about you? When you first meet the narcissist, they project this fantasy or image of perfection onto you. They are projecting these exaggerated traits of their false self. everything they wish they could be. They see you as an extension of them. And they are also using you to prop up their false self and the illusion that they are trying to portray. But everything that they are projecting onto you really has nothing to do with you. It's completely exaggerated. No one is perfect. We all have flaws. We all make mistakes. And then when the narcissist begins to devalue you, that's not an accurate view of you either. They see things in black or white. In their minds you're either good or bad. But in reality, there are both good and bad parts of us. The person the narcissist thinks they knew in the beginning was not us. It was nothing more than a figment of their imagination. Just as when they devalued us. That was not us either. Both of these characters that they created in their minds had nothing to do with us. It was just something they used to regulate their emotions and boost their false sense of self-worth, self-esteem and self-importance. But it had nothing to do with us. This was all going on in their minds. And that is why, if you ask the narcissist, they will say that they know you so well. They might even say that they know you better than you know yourself.
when they really know nothing about you. Really, it's typical for the narcissist to say that they would know you better than you know yourself. In their minds, they are all-knowing, seeing, and they have insight into the actions and thoughts of everyone. When in reality, they just have an exaggerated sense of their own abilities. Because the truth is, they don't know anything about you. They never took the time to get to know you. They never took an interest in anything that you had to say. They never took an interest in anything that you were doing. Because they didn't care. They were too preoccupied with their own thoughts and feelings their own interests and needs and that's just what a narcissist is it's an individual who is self-absorbed someone who is absorbed in their own thoughts activities or interests preoccupied with their own feelings or situation which means that they don't have the capacity to even get to know you they don't have the time or the motivation. They would have no motive for doing that because it wouldn't benefit them in any way unless they were going to use it to manipulate you. And even if they did have the time and the motivation to get to know you, to really connect with you at a human level and evolve in your purpose, passion and feed in your spirit. Even if they try to engage in deep meaningful conversation and develop an emotional connection with you, they wouldn't be able to do that either because they lack empathy. They lack the ability to understand and share the feelings of another. They cannot share your feelings or experiences. They cannot imagine what it would be like to be in yours or another person's situation. They cannot put themselves in your shoes. So how could they ever be able to connect with you? How could they ever get to know you? The narcissist pretends to know everything about you. But really, they don't know anything about you. They never took the time to get to know you. And even if they did, they would not be mentally or emotionally capable of doing that. The best that they can do is to pretend like they know everything about you. They have to do that, because otherwise, if they were to accept that they don't know you, it would mean that they are the problem. It would mean that they have failed at something, and therefore they are not good enough. They are defective. So they pretend, they act like they know everything about you, from the love bombing phase to the devaluation and even after the discard when they assassinate your character and start a smear campaign. Throughout it all, 
They really believe that they know you. They've created these warped definitions of you in their head. And once you've figured out who they really are, then they try to get everyone else to adopt those same negative perceptions of you. Which isn't even you. It doesn't have anything to do with you. It's just something they've created. Just as they did in the love bombing phase. A narcissist cannot get to know anyone. All they can do is interact with the imaginary hero or villain characters in their own minds. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you'd like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsforvercoaching at gmail.com. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.